This tree could put holes in your hand. This dangerous bug can kill a snake. And this tiny jellyfish can kill a human in minutes. And in this video, we're going to take a look at the scariest things you should never touch. Keep watching because some of them you might even be tempted to touch yourself. Let's start with this spiky sea creature. There are about 200 sea urchins in different shapes and colors under the water. You should never make the mistake of touching or standing on one. We can't blame these animals. They're only trying to protect themselves. They have sharp spikes all over over their body, and they also have venom on them. If you get unlucky and touch this animal, first the sting will be very painful, and then the part will be swollen. If not treated on time, it can cause dizziness, paralysis, and even death. So to be on the safe side, once you see an urchin in the water, run. It seems like there are a lot of animals underneath the water that shouldn't be touched. These puffer fish are mostly found in warmer waters and are very dangerous. You should not touch them. One funny aspect of these fish is that they appear harmless, but when they touch any surface, they can cause their bodies to inflate and spikes to emerge from them. Now to sharks and other fish in the sea, it makes them uneatable because of the spikes. But to a human, it can cause severe pain. These strange looking fish contain dangerous chemicals that can cause breathing problems. The flamboyant cuttlefish is another rare and highly venomous water species. The colorful cuttlefish is the only poisonous cuttlefish species in the world. They have a limited lifespan of 18 to 24 months and feed on flesh and meat. These fish hunt for prey throughout the day, but surprisingly, they're harmless to people because they don't inject their venom when they sting or bite humans. But they are highly deadly when consumed and can lead to death if due care is not followed. All these colorful cuttlefish don't transmit venom through bites and stings, another poisonous sea creature does. The blue-ringed octopus is one of the world's tiniest octopus species and also the deadliest. The blue-ringed octopus saliva is so deadly that even a small bite can result in life-threatening paralysis. It can stop muscles from moving. There are four different species of blue-ringed octopus, all of which live in the seas of the Pacific and Indian Oceans and are exceedingly harmful if touched or picked up. They are very beautiful and submissive, so they're always tempting to carry. But hell no, you shouldn't! Another thing that makes them extremely dangerous is that their bite won't be felt, so you might not even know that you've been bitten. But the first sign you'll notice is paralysis within minutes, because their venom contains several powerful chemicals, including tetrodotoxin, dopamine, taurine, and histamine. It's definitely not a pleasant way to die, because most deaths are caused by the inability to breathe. And before that, you won't be able to move at all, so you won't be able to tell anyone close to you what's happening. There is no anti-venom for this thing, so if you get bitten, the only thing you can do is pray. The Indian Red Scorpion is another one of them. It's one of the world's most lethal scorpions. These little scorpions are found throughout India, and their stings are supposed to demand a life-threatening medical emergency. The Indian Red Scorpion is not hostile, and will only attack to defend itself and the venom from the bite targets the pulmonary and cardiovascular systems and can cause death from pulmonary congestion. Other symptoms include shortness of breath, vomiting, alternate heart rate, and high and low blood pressure. By the way, the antivenom for their bites is ineffective, so it's best to just avoid them. While these deadly animals are often rare in certain locations, this next one could be in your backyard and should be avoided at all costs. The world's most poisonous insect appears to be an ant, the harvester ant, and they're commonly found in homes. If you live in Arizona or any of the southern states, then you're probably familiar with them and more than aware of how important it is to keep your distance. Their stinging technique begins with them attaching themselves via their mandibles before injecting their venom, which causes painful blisters that can stay for hours, causing allergic reactions in people and swelling. However, unlike harvester ants, which don't break off after stinging their target and can sting numerous times, these insects can only sting once and can kill if they come in contact with your skin. Everyone knows how deadly bees can be, but as humans, we're always too curious to find out some things we're supposed to just leave. This Africanized honeybee, also known as the killer bee, will chase an intruder for more than a quarter mile to attack. So it's either you're a good runner or you just avoid them. In the past, these bees have killed horses, humans, and other large creatures, so you should be scared of them. It's estimated that they've murdered over a thousand people since their introduction to Brazil. Who would have thought that snails could be dead? From our observation, deadly animals are are very beautiful, and the cone snail is one of them. These snails have beautiful colored shells, which makes them attractive and makes people want to touch them. My advice? Don't! They've been responsible for over 27 deaths, and symptoms can include breathing problems, pains, swellings, blurry vision, and death. The reason why they're so deadly is that they are very slow and need a way to capture their prey. Normally, they wouldn't attack humans, but when they smell a threat, they get into action. How about a plant that'll burn your skin? This plant is the most 
most dangerous in the whole of Canada, and it's called giant hogweed. If your skin comes in contact with its sap and then gets exposed to the sun, it can cause a third degree burn, itching and blisters. In 2018, the plant landed a teenager in hospital with severe burns to his face and body. Although this plant is not common in the USA, when it grows somewhere, it spreads fast and hinders the growth of other plants in the area. So once noticed, it needs to be cut down as soon as possible. Another undersea species that should be avoided like the plague is the blue glaucus. This amazing sea monster that resembles a dragon is a sight to behold, but it's best to admire it from afar rather than get too close to it. The blue glaucus is venomous, and one sting from this species can produce nausea, discomfort, vomiting, acute allergic contact dermatitis, and post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation, as you might expect. So once again, it's preferable to be in awe from afar than to touch it and suffer severe pain. It's crazy that some people have this as a pet. Are you aware that among all the terrifying things stated so far, some trees need to be left alone as well? The manichaeal tree is one of many. It is the deadliest tree on the globe. It's almost like a forbidden fruit. The tree possesses milky white sap that contains numerous poisons and is found in all parts of the tree. Even if you decide to burn down this wood, you're still not safe. Burning it can cause blindness if you stand too near to the smoke. Surprisingly, this tree also produces fruit known as the beach apple. The juice of the fruit, if taken, can harm the entire digestive system. It can also cause burning to the throat and massive swelling, as well as severe abdominal discomfort and bleeding. In a nutshell, this tree and its fruit kills and should be avoided at all costs. If you think these were scary, things are about to get weirder. Keep watching to see what's next. If you think this tree is deadly, wait until you see the next one. This plant called Angel's Trumpet is deadly and can cause horrific hallucinations before killing you. If there was a prize for the most dangerous trees, this tree would win easily. And all parts of this Angel's Trumpet are toxic and contact with it can cause diarrhea, difficulty speaking, respiratory discomfort, and temporary blindness. Scientists have noted that ingestion of the plant can cause temporary insanity. It can only be found in Amsterdam. So the next time you taste a plant outside America, be sure to know where it came from. Seems like everything to come out of Australia can kill you. The Bunya Pine is another example of a frightening tree that you should never touch. The Bunya Pine is a unique and ancient Australian tree that produces dozens of pine cones weighing about 40 pounds each. That's about the same weight as a five-year-old. Well, that's not all. These cones will drop from the tall tree, which is about the height of a nine-story building. I'm pretty sure you don't want to be caught underneath. Many people have been hospitalized as a result of the unexpected hit. Ever heard of the doll of the devil? Back in 2018, there was a horrific doll that went viral when it was discovered on an unmarked headstone in Mexico. Looking at this doll, its eyes follow you like it wants to take your soul away. What made it even scarier was that it was discovered with a baby bottle of blood next to it. Creepy. I'm not sure you wouldn't want to stay next to this doll. But then again, there are numerous other creatures beneath the sea that should never be disturbed, just like this fish here. This crown of thorn starfish is nothing short of dangerous. It looks like a sea urchin, at the same time like an octopus. One lucky thing about these fish is that you can't just find them anywhere. They only exist in the deep blue ocean. If, for example, you go snorkeling or scuba diving, be extremely careful. They have up to 20 legs filled with spikes. I mean, very dangerous and sharp spikes. If you get bitten by this creature, the affected part will swell within minutes, and it can cause bleeding that could last for three hours. I'm pretty sure you don't want that. Starting now, things get even scarier. Keep watching until the end. That's for a species that's hard to find. How about this one you can easily see on the beach? After seeing this, you'll be very careful about your next trip to the beach. The Urukanji jellyfish should be avoided at all costs. They are the rarest, tiniest, and most poisonous jellyfish species out there. There are about 16 recognized species of Urukanji jellyfish, and when they sting their victims, they induce the Urukanji syndrome in them. In some cases, this disorder might result in cardiac arrest and even death. Also, the pain is unbearable. One thing's certain, if you're stung by these jellyfish, you will experience intense and severe pain, as well as muscle cramps and hypertension. There are about 50 to 100 reports of stings from this jellyfish each year. So that's enough evidence to know that this jellyfish hunts for humans. A scary fact is that you can't see them. And even when dead and floating offshore, always make sure to avoid stepping on them because their poison would still be active. I'm sure sometimes you like to touch bugs and just have fun with them. Well, not this one. As you can see in this image, yes, that's what a biter sting from this bug will do to your hand. And I'm not sure that's something you want to have happen to you. This bug is known as Abitus herberti and is also called toe biter because they seem to love to bite human toes. Although they're not very common like the common bugs you see every day, they can be found in South and North America and East Asia. So if you live anywhere in those parts of the world, you need to be extra careful.
careful. These bugs can even kill a snake. Now things get really serious. This tree can explode. Looking at this tree, I don't have to tell you to keep your hands off unless you want to add some holes to your palm. This is the sandbox tree, or as it's popularly called, spikes and grenades. It's covered with cone-shaped spikes, and its sap is poisonous enough to blind the eye. But why would a tree be covered in spikes? Well, it's to protect its fruit. The fruit of the sandbox tree is poisonous, and once drilled into seed capsules, they become a ticking time bomb, exploding with a loud bang almost like a gun. When their seeds are explored, it travels at a speed of 4 kilometers per second and a distance of more than 18 meters, so you definitely don't want to be around the environment when it explodes. The injury can be fatal. Enjoyed the video? Now watch this one.